time and space as we share in Christ the feast that frees us all are welcome all are welcome all are welcome in this place let us build a house where This house proclaim from floor to rafter all our welcome all our welcome all our welcome in this place Thanks Maggie Welcome to Sunday school today I think the only thing you really need to be ready today is your own imagination and your story box. All right, let's listen to Miss Lori tell us what we do need from our story box. Oh, and if you want to do any special wondering, get those art supplies too. Today we will need the In the Beginning deck. We're going to tell a similar but different story. Let's put everything onto the plates so we can get out as the story unfolds. is a very long string. Hmm. You can't even see the ends. This could be the beginning and this could be the end. Or this could be the end, the beginning and this could be the end. Let's tie the beginning and the end together. Let's stretch it out like this. That's easier. It was so long. Now let's take the middle and bring it to the ending that is the beginning. The beginning. That is an ending. And let's put the middle into the middle of our green belt. Sometimes we start going one way, it's the beginning. We end up at the end of the beginning. But then we can go and try another way. But sometimes we end up at the beginning again. But we see things differently because of where we have been and what we have done. Hmm. This reminds me of school. We start at the beginning and the beginning is exciting. And we come to the end, and the ending is exciting. But the ending of school is also the beginning of the summer vacation. And then we come around to the ending of the summer and the beginning of school. And that is exciting too. When the pandemic is over, we will 
I wonder, will we see the beginning and the ending of school differently? I wonder what this summer will bring for us. It is good to have a good leader when you are going through your beginnings and your endings. It is good to have a good shepherd. Here's the sheepfold again. And here are the sheep, the big sheep and the baby sheep. So need our people of God bag. And we also need a little bit of special plate. And Jesus said, I am the good shepherd, and I call my sheep by name, and they hear my voice, and they follow me. parts are difficult. I have to put them through or cheer them on. Now you will hear this story again, but I don't think you can have too much sheep. And here is the table of the Lord. With a special plate and a special cup. And here Jesus feeds his sheep. Hi everyone, I'm Deaconess Claire, and I am wondering if you are ready to listen to a story. Sometimes it helps me get ready to listen to sing a song. And because we're in the Easter season, I thought we might sing a song with the word Alleluia in it. Um, and uh, my daughter is a little bit sleeping right now, so I grabbed two of her toys to help us out. So on this song, anytime you hear the Alleluia, you have to stop the word Alleluia or Allelu, Allelu, or any word that starts with an A, you have to stop moving. So I will demonstrate with these two friends and uh, you can dance, wave your arms, uh, spin in your chair, do you. Uh, stand up, sit down, whatever works. All right, are you ready? Okay, are you ready? Yes. Alleluia, 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 praise ye the Lord. Alleluia, 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 praise ye the Lord. Praise ye the Lord, alleluia, praise ye the Lord, alleluia, praise ye the Lord, alleluia, praise ye the Lord. Make sense? 
All right, let's try it one more time. And this time a little bit faster. Alleluia, 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 praise ye the Lord. Alleluia, 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 praise ye the Lord. Praise ye the Lord, alleluia, praise ye the Lord, alleluia, praise ye the Lord, alleluia, praise ye the Lord. Woo! All right, let's listen to a story. Our story today is The Good Shepherd and the Lord's Supper. We found it in Young Children in Worship on page 201. You can find it in Psalm 23, John 10, and Matthew 18. It's a story that echoes throughout the scriptures. Our storyteller today is Miss Lori. Let's listen. Once there was a man who said such wonderful things and did such amazing things that people began to follow him, but they did not know who he was. So finally, they had to ask him. And he said, I am the good shepherd. And I know my sheep by name. And I call them, and they hear my voice. I'm holding the sheep. And I lead them out and I lead them out of the sheepfold. And I lead them 
Super pasture. through the dangerous places. And then wait, go down. And this is the Lord's table. And here the Good Shepherd feeds his sheep. The special plate and a special cup. if you have ever been at a table like this. I wonder where this place really is. I wonder what it feels like when you hear your name called by the Good Shepherd. Remember when Mary Magdalene at the grave Heard Jesus say, Mary. And she knew that it was Jesus. I wonder who all these sheep are. I wonder if there are other sheep. I wonder if they are happy at the Lord's table. Our Father, who art in heaven, 
hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. It's time for your own work. May this time be a space for creativity and storytelling and blessings.